This is how I look. How I've always looked. Every day, everything is an illusion. So you want normality for me? It's too late for that. And if you don't get your head out of your ass, it'll be too late for you too. The world's burning. Because of your actions. I'm trying to stop them. How? By wrecking millions of lives in your vendetta? It's not a vendetta. I want the world free of heaven and hell. At what cost? Your rage is blinding you. They're retaliating against humanity because of you. You're wrong. They'll do their horror regardless. They're never going to stop. Not until someone stops them first. It's taken me years, but now I finally understand that. Are you out of your mind? You can't stop heaven and hell by yourself. I know, but I need them together. That's why I've been planning for so long. Planning what? The truth. My human form. My costume form. The symbiote. All of it. It's nothing but lies. Even I was fooled by the illusions of what I'm supposed to be. That ignorance cost my wife her life. And if you fail, then what? What about the rest of us? Others will come. Right now, I know exactly where I need to be. What about me? If you don't come back, how do I get home? Al. Albania. This facility is the Nexus heart of toxic chemical shipments. It's also a place where Spawn has learned an army of his enemies await him. All these years, the only thing his enemies craved was his power, his symbiote costume. Tonight, Spawn plans to give them that chance. Outside, dozens of men construct new train tracks to help speed the delivery of these canisters of poison. But it's inside the vicinity that confuses Spawn. Because instead of being filled with workers or an awaiting army, it's empty. With barely any evidence anyone was ever here. Then, a hulking silhouette appears across the warehouse. Hello, Spun. I've been expecting you. Spawn coldly stares back in silence. What did you think? That we would just let you have your way with us? That was never gonna happen. Now was it? So tell me, how was it going to work? Were you going to destroy our corporate structure, our political influence? <laughs> We're everywhere. You know that, right? <laughs> you thought you could disrupt our entire infrastructure? Not all of it. Just enough to get the attention of someone at the top. Well, now you have mine. Let me return the favor. <laughs> it burns, doesn't it? You've always been much weaker in the light. What side did you come from? Me? <laughs> I'm like you. Part demon, part vampire. And we both thrive in the darkness. But more importantly, I'm the one you made. <laughs> Without you, I would never have been able to ascend to my current position. So, in an odd way, the thing you're feeling, it's of your own making. <laughs> and the power you've enjoyed hosting your symbiote, <laughs> well, that's about to end. <laughs> I helped create that suit you're wearing. I know more about it than you. So before you die tonight, you're going to see who its true master is. Rise, my pet. Rise up! <laughs> You were never worthy to be a Hellspawn, Simmons. <laughs> Your kind never should have been given the costume. None of you deserved it. You sound 
like someone I knew. Someone jealous of humans. And I see by your tattoo, you must have been an admirer of his. Too bad I decapitated him. Did you? You must be quite proud. Mabogia than the clown. Maybe I shouldn't kill you. Maybe I should keep you as his slave. That's not what we agreed to. Ah, uh, godsend. Glad you could join us. You. My partner said you'd met. Everyone keeps warning me how much tougher, how powerful you can be. They said the same about Angela and all her whore angels. Right before my seraphim wiped them out. One last thing. I want to thank you for transforming me. <laughs> all I had to do to receive your gift was kill your wife. To gut poor little Wanda. That's all I've been waiting to hear. He burst from his chains, shoving his spiked fist into the chest of his enemy. Extracting his heart. Surely, you can do better than that. What are you? Take a look. You always thought I was a joke. A clown. Not anymore! Violator? You've taken our money, our influence. Now, we're gonna take from you the only thing you care about. By poisoning every last human on this planet. We can't rule this planet. Then we'll make sure no one else ever will. Not you. You're a fraud, just like the others. And just like them, you're weak, like those in the New Bible. But I'm Old Testament! He's near death. Collect what you came for. Like a vulture, fire later begins to pick away at Swan's flesh. Piece by painful piece, he strips off the symbiote as Spawn takes his last breath. You'll get your share of it. Keep your damn costume. He's just another of Hell's failed champions. The Spawn. Hadn't failed. He'd been waiting. Waiting for the perfect time to throw his spark. And then light it. For a quarter mile radius, everything is wiped out. The only things left standing are those not born here on Earth. Are you okay, clown? Look. It's him. Why won't you die? I have your costume! I've got your powers! You're wrong. And you've always been wrong. Then, from the ashes, Simmons begins to build it. First, it's his markings. Then his chains, his belt, his cape. You've been chasing the wrong thing. It wasn't the symbiote that gave me powers, that made me what I am. It never was. And finally, his spiked gloves. <clears throat> the costume didn't make me spawn. Because I 
damn spawn.